Okay, just I decided to check out on the previous video and I just remembered where I am. But I also remembered that I must forget, so let's forget everything and just move on. You'll now see that the path is somewhat clear. Flood, thank heavens you're here. I think Lighter and Fleo are still stuck inside the forest. Don't worry, I'll have back these rubber dickers. You just hurry and fight them. Where's the fire? Is it on fire? Ooh, I bet it's a big giant foresty fire. This is a big emergency. So good it came to head out, but everyone will let me through. I can be useful too. I know I'm not just some annoying onlooker. Yes, you are. But just get it all the way. And it is smoking. <coughs> oh, it's you, friend. I thought it was someone that finally hit me walking this way. The smoke is terrible, and with my sensitive quote, I can't continue any further. We have to have this cookie instead. Let this slightly ungreen and not very tasty cookie be of use. Please let it be of use. Alright, alright, I'll give you one for my slightly unclean yet not very cookies. Let it be of use. So you must talk to him again. Alright, alright, I'll give you one more of my slightly ungreen and not very tasty cookies. Let it be of use. I know you want more, but... <laughs> so, right there, if you keep talking to him and you get up to three cookies. And it looks like you finally encountered a new enemy. Mr. Betty blocked the way. Now, let's see if I can actually get the beat this time. And also, you can have special moves, his brute force, swing, basically swings at the enemy, he does ton much more damage than just a typical, um, bash. Power smash, basically builds up power and does a, um, guaranteed smash attack, but has a high chance of missing. Strikes enough, basically makes, increase your attack power, tough enough, increases your defense. I'll just go ahead and do my typical b bash and see if I can do a combo. And I didn't. Okay, I did not get any combos. However, I should mention something. So I'll leave this forth and come back for it. As you can see, that was a Mr. Batty. However, you want to try to get a back attack on it. I was unsuccessful, couldn't run. Did not get a back attack. Couldn't run. You really want a back attack on all these enemies. Just trust me. Shoot, and it's difficult because I can't even see it. Okay, let's try to run away. Couldn't run. And already got a smash attack. Actually, I'll cut until I get a back attack on it. Actually, never mind, because there's actually another bat that is much easier to get a back attack here. Or I don't get a back attack at all. Actually, I got a back attack in just two more tries. Now, let me tell you, when you get a back attack, the screen turns green. The screen will turn green as opposed to blue. However, there is a chance that you can get back to tech, in which case the screen turns red. And this is what happens. You basically get a free hit because the enemy must take some time to turn around. And when you get a free hit, when you successfully back attack an enemy, you'll find his back sprite. Now in the original game, back sprites were not that great at all. 
But in this game, it's important to get what? Eh, what am I saying? In the fan translation, it's important that you get back attacks because of something special that Tomato added. And we got a smash attack. Very nice. And there's somebody knocking on door. Where could Isaac be? Poor Matt. And got an Aries bracelet. Good idea to equip that. A was the Aries Zodiac time increases defense by three. Very nice to get that now. Over here is a hot spring. And what's interesting is that hot springs, well, they heal you. Unfortunately, you get naked. As you can see closely, there is no clothes on Flint or Thomas. And that's kind of creepy, but oh well. Have to deal with the cosmetic changes. And he's whipping clapped, and see, I actually got a combo right there. If you're really good, you can get up to 16 hit combos, and as you can see, I got a two hit combo. Oh, Bronson. Oh, Flynn. <coughs> I bleed too much smoke. Leiter and his son fuel are still I'm back yet. I'm pretty sure they're stuck inside the forest. <coughs> Don't worry about me. Go get help them. Right. And over here, you'll see some fire. Touching them will do damage to you. So keep that in mind. Just avoid the flames. Huh? Those fireflies? And he just ran through the flames. And we cannot run through those flames after them, but a metal box like object is lying here. Huh. Now over here. Get a back attack? And you'll find a yam yeah monster. You snuck on it from behind. Woo! Three hit combo! And it turned around, so we got his back sprite from the start. Thankfully, it has an easy beat to deep get, and we got to level up. Inside was some nut bread. Flint took the nut bread. Now I guess this is a good time to talk about stats. Level apparently is basically how close you are. By the time you reach level 100, you can no longer increase your stats. Offense, basically how much damage you can attack. Defense determines how much damage you can receive. IQ is base. My IQ basically um, increase your psychic attacks, but we don't have those yet. Speed determines um, who moves first, and that's pretty much it. Here we go. We got another monster, and we already got another bank attack. Yeah, monsters are easy to get a bag attack on. You just need to keep them from getting out of the ground. Because once they get out of the ground, you cannot bag attack them. Because they'll always look at you. Actually, they're not coming out of the ground. That's strange. I'm probably thinking of a future version of these monsters. And yes, I <laughs> that actually made me jump because I didn't think I was hitting the fire. Okay, got a front attack. You, I guess you really have to pay attention to where their eyes are. Okay, I'm getting two head combos. That's good. All right, got some more nut bread. Let's take the time to look around in case we can find any more presents. Okay, the flames look kind of thick there, so I'm going to avoid it. And... Hmm, looks like somebody's there. You've never seen a bug like this before. Uh, biter! Hey. 
Hey, Binder! Are you alright? Blood. No, and harmless. D damn it! <coughs> I tried to beat these things up, but more just keep coming. I can't get past them. That thing, a bug? <coughs> no, no. You're getting around the forest and lighting fires. But never mind that. Phil's still at home. What? Phil's still in your shack? Flint, you got to help Phil. I'll look after lighter. Now it's a good idea to grab this. Lighter's lumber. It's possible for you to miss that, so make sure you equip it. Also increases speed. Lighter's favorite 4x4. Very good to have that. Also, good idea to heal as well. Okay, fully... I'm fully healed. Let's move up. Hmm? Four of them. Three of them seem to be surrounding us. And here they are attacking. A firefly and its cohorts attack. Well, let's go ahead and take them out then. Okay, they seem to be using fire based attacks, but they're not doing much. Alright. Good thing that we gotta level up this soon because, well, they're pretty easy at this point. I could do two hit combos and they're out. One more attack because I did not get a two hit combo, but thankfully it missed. Inside the present with some nut bread. Time to move up. More flames, then over here is basically a frog in a barrel of water. No choice but to go up to the house. Help! Huh? That certainly isn't a firefly that we just encountered. Okay, let's use some nook cookie then. That should fully... Actually, we're getting close to being fully healed, but I'll just go in as is. You could bust it open by ramming into it. And it seems like there's some kind of mouse enemy. Can't seem to interact with it. So let's go up. Huh? Oh, now it attacks? A flying mouse suddenly attacked. Well, you can't get a back sprite of this yet. However, you can later on. Just remember that. Okay, didn't do very well in the combos there. But Flint luckily leveled up. Okay, we're up in the house now. Uh oh. Player seems to be in trouble. Huh. No problem here. Oh, okay. So go ahead, grab that down, and get him. Mr. Flint! You dug fuel into your care. Now let's get out of here! House is falling apart! Get out! Looks like the house finally collapsed. Sorry to say, but you're homeless now, but you're at least you're safe. Ah! I'm pitch black and 
covered in suit, but I'm alive. Oh, you're pitch black too, Mr. Flint. Racist. Thank you, Mr. Pitch Black Flint. Thank you so, so, so much, Mr. Pitch Black Flint. Oh, yeah. We need to let my know that... No, Dad, I'm okay. Dad, know that I'm okay. He's probably worried sick about me somewhere. Now, let me show you something really cool as we get back down. I don't think there's any enemy he's left. Okay, there's some, yeah, monsters left, but we don't need... But since we got their back straight, I'm not gonna worry too much about them. So let's go ahead and find the hot springs so we can go ahead and heal ourselves. There's the box where those pig masks... Well, the, at least those guys in pig masks have been hanging out. And I just recklessly ran through the fire. Let's go to the hot spring. And take a bath with a little boy. Okay, I'll stop. But there is one, a secondary reason why we should be in the hot spring. Why? That is really cool detail that they added. Wash off half of the soot. That is really cool. And it seems like there's some Abbott and Matt are here. Hi, I don't know who you are, Mr. Pitch Black Guy, but thanks a million for saving Phil. Well, you really are a Pitch Black. Racist. Oh, Mr. Flint and Phil, you two are both big black, but I knew it was you the instant I saw you. Huh? Oh, this injury? Actually, about that. Yes, this injury. Abby here was attacked by some bizarre flying mouse thing with bug wings. It just went jump and bit her on the head. Yeah, that makes sense. If it didn't, I can explain to you again. That won't be necessary. Hey. Made sense to me. Yeah, that was a uh, very easy to understand explanation. Alright. Anyways, we're about to leave Sunshine Forest. So, I think... Actually, you know what? I'll do the cutscene that's coming up and then I'll end the video, alright? Thomas is here. Fred, you're pitch black and covered in soot. But you're alright. Jeez, I haven't heard that before. Being the responsible band and I am, I managed to bring lighter here. Hurry up and see fuel. Dad! Oh, he's really injured. Th that voice. Is that you, fuel? You alright? What, what in the world happened to you? Your pitch black and covered in suit. A million people told us that already. Even though that this village has a population of like 15. What about you, Dad? You busted your leg. Oh, this? It ain't nothing. All I gotta do is twist it like so, and then this, and then... Ah! 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 ah come son it! <sighs> Bro, boss, what in the world are you doing? Fixing my injuries, obviously. What does it look like? Anyways, we sure are looking Flint showed up, and when we did... Yeah. He and others always been carrying bodies since they were kids. It makes me... It's enough to make me jealous. Thanks, Flint. I guess I should. My not-so-tough slide, huh? I owe you one for today. I think that could be the first time I've ever heard the boss thank anyone. <laughs> You're right. The only thing that couldn't make this any stranger if it suddenly started pouring rain. And now it started to rain. No, wait, that was that. Now it's starting to rain. I hope this puts out the fire. We need to tend lighter. Let's head back to the village for now. The 
Yardo in. What is Yardo anyways? Tessie, huh? Like the monster from Earthbound? Heh. <laughs> there you are, Flint. You're all patched up now. It's a good thing you and Fuel only suffered light injuries. It's been a while since Tesmilly last had rain. Well, then that's good for the crops. Flint, let's get some nice rest. Flint, do you see anything else in the fire besides those weird bugs? I'm talking about some suspicious people with pig masks. On those bastards, they turned the forest pitch black. And you, Flynn, you wound up pitch black too. You should get some rest now, Dad. Oh, yeah, you were pitch black too, Fuel. Come on, Dad, you really need to rest now. Let's go ahead and talk to Jackie. Hey, dear Flint, sorry I wasn't much help earlier. But if something ever happens again, I promise I'll help you out. You'll be tired, so you should get some rest. The room to the far at the east is... and is unoccupied. What about in here? Okay. And here is a safe frog. And over there is a pillow where you can rest. Plus, a present. Got an antidote that'll come into use later. But for now, I'm gonna go ahead and use this safe frog. And next time on Let's Play Mother 3, well, time to step out of the end and continue on with the story. Maybe find out more about those pig masks. I'll see you guys then. <laughs>